Bonjour et bienvenue à Learn French with Alexa. Today, folks, we are going to learn words on clothes. Ok, les habits ou les vêtements. Deuxième partie, part two. Ok, you will find that I have already posted part one of les vêtements. Here we go. First word on les vêtements, le peignoir. Le peignoir. And this is the bathrobe. The bathrobe. The bathrobe, you say? Bathrobe, Adam? Dressing gown. Oh, the dressing gown. What's a bathrobe? Just made that one up. <laughs> it's a dressing gown. Le peignoir. Now, or oh, un peignoir. Okay, a dressing gown. Un tailleur. Un tailleur. It's a women's suit. Suit. Working. Suit. 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 Le tailleur. Le Tailleur. Un costume. Un costume. Ou le costume. Ok. Un costume. Now, the difference between un and le, by the way. Un is a and le is the. Ok. So, un costume is a man's suit. Can't say it. Un pyjama. Un pyjama is a pyjamas. 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 Un pyjama. Des sandales. That sandals. Des sandales. Ok? Des chaussures. Shoes. Des chaussures. Ok, have a look. C'est ça ma chaussette, by the way. Chaussette is socks. Des chaussures. Des pantoufles. Pantoufles, slippers. Des pantoufles. Do you own a pair of slippers? Because I don't. But uh, please feel free to buy me a pair. <laughs> Des pantoufles. Un maillot de bain. And that's a swim suit, okay? Un maillot de bain. Un maillot de bain. A swim suit. Un survêtement. That's a track suit. Un survêtement. Ok? Un vêtement, the word vêtement means clothes. Des baskets. And that's trainers. Des baskets. Ok? As in basketball, literally. Right. Let's have a look at the list one more time. Ok? Here it goes. Un peignoir. And that's a dressing gown. Un Peignoir. Un tailleur. Un tailleur is a women's suit, working suit. Un costume. As the man's one, the man's suit. Un costume. Un pyjama. Un pyjama. I'm not going to tell you what that means. You know what that means. Un pyjama. Des sandales. Des sandales, des chaussures, des chaussures, des pantoufles, des pantoufles, un maillot de bain, un maillot de bain, un maillot de bain, as well, when we say it fast in French, maillot de bain, un survêtement, un Survêtement. Des baskets. Des baskets. And that's trainers. Okay? Right. What you can do is make a sentence using je porte. Now, je porte means I wear. Okay? Je porte. And you can elab elaborate a sentence, you know, make it more and more complex. So you can start simple by saying je porte. Uh, des sandales, I wear sandals, but you could say I wear red sandals. So, je porte des sandales rouges, ok? Des sandales rouges. I wear little red sandals, je porte des petites sandales rouges. See where the adjectives are here? 
je porte des petites sandales rouges. That's because the adjective petit is used the same way as you use it in English, okay, before the noun. But rouge is a color and like most adjectives in French are put after the noun, okay. You could say as well, je porte un survêtement. Je porte un survêtement. I wear a tracksuit, okay. Je porte un petit survêtement. I don't know why I said that. Ou je porte un survêtement bleu et rouge. Blue and red. Okay? So make your own sentences and leave a comment right here. Uh, and also subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to be kept updated by what goes on. That's it for me. Au revoir. À bientôt. Bisous, bisous.